Hey guys, Crypto Dad here again, and today I'm going to show you how to convert your cryptocurrency dust that you may have on the Binance exchange to BNB tokens in anticipation for the new mainnet swap that will be occurring on April 23rd. So let's dive in. All right, so uh, let's check out the news on Binance. Uh, things are looking pretty good for Binance Coin. All right, so I'm looking at an article here uh, that Binance is uh, recently revealed their timeline for the BNB uh, cryptocurrency move off Ethereum. Uh, if you're not familiar with the way Ethereum works, uh, it is a cryptocurrency that hosts a lot of sub tokens. So uh, a lot of tokens live on the Ethereum blockchain as what we call an ERC-20 token. And Binance is one of those tokens. But uh, the Binance coin will soon be running on its own mainnet. So we're going to need to convert our ERC-20 tokens, uh, ERC-20 Binance tokens, to the full-blown Binance token off, uh, their new, into their new mainnet. So uh, if you don't know what BNB coin is or Binance coin, uh, let's take a look here. Uh, Binance is uh, one of the largest cryptocurrency exchanges out there and uh, they host their own coin, which as I mentioned is now an ERC-20 token. So the value of the Binance token uh, keeps going up in anticipation of the launch of the new Binance mainnet. So uh, Binance Coin is actually one of the first coins to hit their all-time high since 2017, which is pretty impressive because if you're familiar with the cryptocurrency market, uh, most of the cryptocurrencies out there uh, are well off their highs, or in fact all of them, uh, with the exception of Binance at this point. So uh, it's a pretty impressive feat to hit their all-time high. So uh, let's dive in and uh, take a look at how we're going to convert our Binance coin. So uh, there's an article here uh, about uh, what the information that Binance has released so far. Uh, basically what they've said is that on April 23rd there will be a mechanism to convert your Binance coin uh, that's currently the ERC-20 type coin to the full-blown Binance coin. Uh, so they've released the date, and then down here where they talk about uh, the address, they'll say that users will be able to provide a Binance chain address for BN BNB withdrawal requests. So uh, that's really all the information that we have so far. Uh, we don't know how we're gonna get a hold of this address. So we're just gonna have to stay tuned. But the important thing is, is that you have a little bit of BNB that's ready to go. And it's really not that difficult to convert any cryptocurrency to Binance coin on the Binance exchange. So uh, let me demonstrate that. All right, we'll just head over here to Binance. We'll get ourselves logged in. All right, and if you've got two-factor authentication enabled, you'll put in that code. All right. Now, let me show you uh, what I would call the standard method that uh, most people can use. Let's say you have a cryptocurrency that is currently uh, on, in your Binance account. Uh, in this case, I'm going to choose a ZRX. So I have a little bit of ZRX in my Binance account. So I'll just go over here to trade. Uh, and if you're not in this interface, you want to go over here to funds and balances. All right, this is where it shows all the cryptocurrency that you currently have stored on the exchange. We'll go over here to the trade button. And you can see here all the trading pairs of all the different cryptocurrencies. So this ZRX cryptocurrency is in its own Binance wallet. So we can trade that for BTC, Ethereum, uh, US Tether, or Binance Coin. That's usually the first option. So we can just click that and go over to the trading interface. 
And in this case, we can just go to Sell ZRX, and we can choose how much of our ZRX we want to sell. Uh, in today's case, I'm going to choose 100%, and that's going to net me 2.53 Binance coins. So I'll just hit Sell ZRX. All right, and that creates a limit order, and my ZRX gets converted to Binance coin. Now, that used to be the go-to method for me. But uh, check out my wallet. I've had, uh, or let's check out my, uh, my total funds in Binance. As you can see here, I have some of uh, what we would call dust. So uh, there's 52 ADA on here. So let's go to trade that and hit the ADA BNB pair. And then we'll try to sell our ADA for Binance coin, 100%. See what happens. No, order failed. So basically this transaction is too small. So what am I going to do to uh, just exchange this small amount of ADA into BNB? Pretty simple. We'll just go back over here to the funds balances uh, area. And we'll just click this little button up here where it says convert to BNB. And when we click that, They've got all of these tick marks here for all of these cryptocurrencies, cryptocurrencies that we've acquired uh, through airdrops and whatnot, uh, uh, hard forks, any kind of uh, conversion that was supported by Binance. I have a lot of uh, what you would call cryptocurrency dust. So I have everything ticked off by default. Now let's say you have a cryptocurrency in here that you'd like to hang on to. You could just untick it. Not that difficult, right? If you want to hang on to something. In today's case, I'm just going to convert all of my so-called dust into BNB, right? And it's going to net me 0.1943 something something uh, Binance coin. So I'm just going to hit this convert to BNB down here. And it's going to tell me how much it's going to get me and I'll hit confirm. And lo and behold, all of the small balances of all that cryptocurrency that was just sitting around on Binance doing nothing has now been automatically converted to Binance coin. We'll go over here to balances and we'll see oh, that I've got uh, 6.27 Binance coin. Now I think these uh, balances here are just uh, kind of ghost balances, if you will. All right, and then we can see here that uh, we converted our BNB, uh, all of the other coins to BNB. Let's see here. Yeah, there's a list of all the little current cryptocurrencies that we had sitting on the exchange that got converted over to BNB. So uh, the funds are showing up a little bit still and uh, shouldn't be too long before those are all zeroed out and we'll just see that BNB coin uh, in our account. All right, guys, so that's it. Thanks for joining me. Don't forget I have a live stream every Friday night, 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Please join me for the live Q&A in LA. Uh, throw out any questions that you may have and I'll do my best to get them answered on the fly. Hope to see you there. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you'd like to subscribe to my channel, I would appreciate it. When you subscribe, there's a little bell that you can click that will allow you to be alerted whenever I post new content. Once again, thanks for joining me and hope to see you again soon.